Alright, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, victims of all ages, what's up motherfuckers? Wishing you folks a gracious good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever time it may be for you, wherever the world you folks may be. Thank you for coming and hanging out. You know we're going to get fucked up, we're going to make fun of some retards, we're going to make fun of some cops, and that's what we do over this bitch. Now, I'm sitting here, and I'm thinking I'm, I'm about to have an intellectual conversation with, with, with the neighbor. Me and her like to burn together, and normally we'll get into intellectual conversations. So this is how I started out our intellectual conversation today. I say, you know, you know the best thing about just killing a hooker? And she was like, oh my God, what? And I said, not only do you get your money back, but you get a whole nother hour for absolutely free. Now, she says to me, you need therapy. You need therapy. I said, yeah, I know. No shit. And she was like, I don't understand. Why do men start a podcast instead of just going to therapy? Uh, here, for the same fucking reason that women start an OnlyFans page instead of getting a job. Uh, I'm not a whore. Yeah, I know. I'm a mom. I'm a proud mom, not a whore. Yeah, I know, bitch. I know, bitch. The only thing funnier than that I've heard in a long time was killing a blind kid by giving him a gun and telling him it's a hair dryer. And speaking of people dying, you folks think that Stephen Hawking was an organ donor because, like, I, I'm trying. I need some spare parts for a go kart, and I'm thinking he might be able to have the shit I need. Think about how bad that would suck to have two hands and can't clap. On the positive side, I just heard that there was another school shooting here in the United States, so it's good to see that we're back on the right track. Everything's getting back to normal again. That's that's good to know. Here's another thing that's good to know. I don't know if there's any uh, Marvel fans out there, um, but Marvel is redoing one of their X-Men, and uh, this one is going to be just all transgender. X-Men trans... Anywho... I just kind of feel like everyone that goes, that, that, that falls into this fucking transgender, this LDHD TV community, all these companies that are fucking bending to their fucking mental illness are all losing badly. And I know some people have said before, some folks have actually said, you have to lose something to learn something. But I'll tell you this, I know a few fucking cancer patients that have lost, and I don't think they learned any fucking thing at all. Hey, you guys are poor and cared for, valuable, unbelievably appreciated over this bitch. Um, hopefully you folks can see me. I can't believe it. There's actually sunshine over here today. But look, I got these three videos for you folks today. First one comes from Good Guy Activism. Fuck the goddamn NYPD, man. They're all fucking tyrant assholes over there. The second one comes from Wolverine Transparency. This is the Allen Park Police Department. They overreact like a bunch of little bitches. They get checked, owned, and dismissed. And uh, the last video comes from Dre Flacco. This is when the police come to your house uh, who hardly speak fucking English, which is amazing to me. How would you know what my constitutional rights are when you can hardly speak the fucking language? But that's neither here nor there. But in this video, this is when the police come to your house fucking six, seven deep to do a fucking welfare check and then threaten to arrest you if you don't show them your ID over a welfare check. Not a crime, a welfare check. Hoy vey, man. Look, you guys know what time it is. Roll it up, twist it up, light it up, spark it up, shoot it up, whatever the fuck it is you folks do to get there, get there with me. Pour your bottles, let's bust up some weed, put a little motherfucking gas in the air and get ready to these videos. Good guy activism, kick off for us. Show us what happened, my dude. Let's go. My people love this country and we're under attack. They banning us, they cancel us for speaking the facts. If you man enough, come stand with us, take USA back. And every time we pull up, all you're gonna see is American flags.
Lau. Can't see shit anyways. You from the 111? Where's that at? Queens? Bayside. Yeah. My boy's on two phones. Get off your phone, pay attention. Thank you. You guys do know what prior restraint is, right? That's the apartment vehicle. Stay away from the vehicle. What are you doing? What's your name? Huh? What's your name? Right there. You know what prior restraint is? Yeah. So what are you doing? That's what you're committing. Okay. Don't come too near to my vehicle again. I'm gonna start with sir. Okay. Good. Can I get your card, please? Right there. Since you committed prior restraint. What? You committed prior restraint. Okay. You, yeah. you flash your Next flash time, do not come towards the vehicle. You understand me? Do you understand me? He's talking to me, right? All right. I'm still waiting for his card. There you go. So I can hold him accountable. Go, go ahead, sir. Don't come too Are close to the vehicle. Are you threatening me with arrest? No, don't come close to the vehicle. You'll be warned. If you don't want warning for what? Right, stop. Just, just you just, I just had to fucking say something to me, right? Okay, I'm on a sidewalk recording. You're supposed to protect this, not Good. fucking come up to me. So why are you trying to intimidate me? Why are you threatening me with arrest? He asked you to step away from the vehicle. Yes, you did. He asked you to step you away from the vehicle. You just said that. I'm on the sidewalk. He asked you to step away from the vehicle. I'm on the that's sidewalk. Cool. That's cool, yeah, but just step away from the vehicle, that's all. I'm on the sidewalk. You're good. Just step away is, from the vehicle. No. Is it a crime to stand next to the vehicle? I'm You're trying to understand. Too close to the vehicle. Is that a crime? I'm trying to understand. Is you that a crime? You're close to the vehicle. You understand? Will I get arrested? I, need... I don't know what you're doing. Listen. I'm taking Listen, pictures. I'm we're smoking asking, a cigarette. We're asking you to step we're asking I'm smoking you to stay a cigarette. Away from the vehicle. That's all. You can record. You if can you're asking pictures. me, I could decline it, right? Sir. Because I'm on a sidewalk. I'm not I committing tell a crime. You again, stay away from the vehicle. You can, you can take, you can record. You do what you want. Don't get too close to the vehicle. That's all I wanted to ask you. You understand? For my safety, your safety. You understand? Whose safety is more important? Yours my or mine? My safety and your safety, sir. You understand? Who's more that? important? Okay. I don't know you. I didn't swear over to protect your safety. You, know, you, you know swore some, over to protect my safety, you know remember? Some people have guns over here. I don't they have, have guns. They have killed officers before. Not me. Yeah, right, well, so just, not you. I feel like you know Somebody asked you to step back. That's what if he asked me to smack myself? I got to smack myself? Okay. That's your choice. Because he asked That's me? Your choice. That's he your asked choice. Me? Because you you trying to push your ego on me. I'm not committing a crime. I'm standing on the sidewalk. I'm filming the cars. So what's the big deal? What is the big deal? Why are you putting your ego on me? Why not say Happy New Year, sir? How what happens if I stay next, next to the car? I need to know. Enjoy your night. If you're gonna put your ego on me, tell me what happens if I stay next to the car. Enjoy your night. I need to know. Will I get arrested if I stayed on the sidewalk? 
The fuck is all that about, bro? You don't have to do that. I walked to 18 cars. All right, so Nobody said nothing to me. Your name. So that's what's, what's the problem? You. Why that's you? What telling you. Why are you trying to violate my rights? Nobody's doing anything. So what happens if I stay next to the, not one to the time, car? Not one time have we told you you can't record. You just said so I can't stand. Say, why are you saying we're violating your rights? Because you just said I can't stand on the sidewalk. We asked you, we asked you to move away from the vehicles. And I'm, Nobody I'm said anything the about cars. the recording. Nobody said anything about... I can't about, investigate you? I can't listen, watch you while you work? Just step away from the vehicles because everybody over here is working. That's all it is. Okay. And That's I'm all watching you while you work. What's That's the, awesome. Do I have the right to watch you while you work? That's awesome. That's awesome. Listen, nobody said anything about the sidewalk or the recording. That's where I was at. Enjoy your night. That's where I was at. So what's the problem? Enjoy your night. What's the crime? You want to threaten me with arrest, but you don't want to threaten me with arrest. Nobody's threatening you. So what do you mean? Don't stay next to the cars. Have a good night. The fuck? And this is why I record y'all, because y'all can't help but to show your fucking ass, bro. I don't get it. You see that shit? What's his, how you say his last name? You gotta read it, brother. I can't read I don't know how to read. Listen. I don't know how to read. Can I, where is he? So, I can't go next to no cop cars in America. That's what you're saying? In New York, I can't go next to no cop cars. Listen, while we're working right now, we asked you okay, to just give some Okay, That's you. all it is. Sergeant, how do That's you say your last is. name? I don't know how to read. Can you pronounce it for me, please? Yo, bro, I went up to every cop car on this block recording. I don't see what the issue is, bro. I'm trying to ask you how you no, say your you last name. The police. You following us? You harassing? I'm asking you. Aggravating harassment. How do you say your last name? I, I, sure, I can ask you. Right there. Me ask you questions is not harassment. You got my car. What else do you want? I don't know how to say your last name. How do you say it? That's because you don't care about CCRBs. You don't care about internal affairs. Of course you. You don't care about nothing. You don't care about nothing. I'm gonna stand right here. Watch you. Oh. Harassing, we're harassing the police. Can you believe that? You're harassing the police. You guys passed out in the back seat? Yo, they're all just bullshitting around, bro. Yo, but what's the one guy passed out in the back seat? they all sleeping in the car. It's not doing <laughs> shit. They don't want you to see that. That's why they like, what the fuck? They let them tip their windows. Bro, they are fucking arresting me six times for doing exactly this, bro. <laughs> six times. And have you gotten off? Yeah, all six. Beat all six, bro. <laughs> These motherfuckers ain't our friends, bro. They'll shoot us, bro. Right now, that sergeant want to shoot me, bro. These niggas is dirty. I don't fuck with these niggas, bro. God bless you. I'm going to more cop cars. I'm going to go film every fucking cop car I see. Fuck that. You're not, you're not going to take away my rights. You're not taking away my rights. Fuck that. Fucking lucky I can't take an arrest right now, bro. Dirty ass niggas. <laughs> Fucking dirty, bro.
Your destination is on the left. Uh, I'm not sure if it's on a TV or not. KA, alert. Tom is unable to get to the door to unlock it. I don't, I don't know how you can gain angry. Hey! You! See, I'm being stared at by a bootlicker already. What do you want? All I did was say hi. Okay, so what I need to do is... Uh, No, I'm a cop watcher. I'm here to watch them. You got what you wanted. The press is here. Take a look. This is what you wanted. You're going to get it. Hey, baby, they closing it down? They closing it down? Hey, how you doing? You guys were taking care of your business and you got interrupted, huh? That's sad. Bunch of bootlickers. Look at this. They just got to hold up the street. See this? See how they hold up the street? I can't get in. I can't get out. I'm trapped. <laughs> yeah, record me, recording the podies. I'm on your side, man. Hello. Be careful, you might you turn into a bootlicker before you know it, man. Yeah. How can I get through? How am I supposed to get through? I know, this is 257.676B impeding traffic. Holy you're blocking the streets without code three. 603. Not being applied. 257. 603. Here, since they're going to cite them, I'm going to cite the police. I'm going to give all y'all tickets for blocking the streets. You're blocking the street and I can't get through. I don't see the emergency. Nobody's shot. Nobody's killed, right? But I can't get through. So the people that they, they called across the street, they could use their driveway. Okay, if you're going to leave, you're going to leave. Okay, if you're parked, That's bad. All right, there's a really bad symbol. Hey, did you guys call the police on the police? 257-676-B says they're not allowed to do this. Without And 603 says they have to have their lights on. And they're in my way, man. Since you bootlickers want to call the law on somebody having a freaking party, call the... Look at this. It's got his shit all open. All this for that? Come on, man. Y'all need to clear the street, man. You blocking the street, that's against the law. You guys are committing to CI. I mean, takes a one arm handicapped guy to come and check y'all. They are. They're blocking traffic. This is called obstructing traffic. 
can't block the public roads. Come on, guys. Move your vehicles out. This ain't an emergency. Well, you didn't know where to park first, though. Well, there's a driveway right there. There's a driveway right there. The lady who called you, the lady who called you has three spots. Yeah, that's that's what I thought. PTFO, baby. Kick rocks, y'all. Kick rocks. You're welcome. It don't take four, no, it don't. Four it don't. This is a waste park. of resources. You know, it's just a party. Right now, there's a woman being on the other side of Allen Park. And they, and they got four police cars over here for some babies. Yeah. Oh, they're going to be after me now. No, that's all right. We'll record them. Right. Record them, man. All I want to do is get through the street, and I can't because they're blocking it. Right. Like, if, uh, like, like somebody get back. Yeah. yeah. Hopefully them hopefully the fire trucks ain't on their way. Hopefully there ain't nobody having a medical emergency on this on this street. Cause they can't get through. Don't worry, I chase the boy. You guys can go back to your party. Yeah. I wanted to be able to get through. I couldn't get through. Sister I can't get through up there. This is a dead end. Okay. Uh, alert. Yeah, so that was the only call that we had. Just one call for one floor. You see how that lady? She drove. She booked up. She's the one that had three spots back there in her driveway. Oh. It's not about me liking police or not. Well, it doesn't matter. You don't see nobody out there. You guys are clear. Are they? Are they? Are they? Are they, are they you hear that? You guys got two calls. Go on, get the fuck out of here. You got two emergency calls. They're calling you right now. Get out of here. Come on, man. They're calling you. I just heard it on the radio. You guys are clear, man. Clear this, man. They're telling you to clear, clear. Clear, man. Forget the bootlickers. One of you been to a graduation party. One. Ooh. You're dismissed. Three, four. That's right. PTFO. Have a good night. Happy f the police day. Happy f the police day. They know my ass. I don't f with them. See when they but when they block in your street like that and ain't nobody shot and ain't nobody killed, tell them to get on, man. Just tell them to go on. And all they were all they worried about is, you know, who's gonna write who a ticket. So what? Tell them to get the right and get on. And they got so tired for you had heard it in my radio. Their commander was saying, You guys need to clear the scene. Go hey, go on Wolverine transparency right now. Rewind and listen to their commander calling them back. Tell them to clear the area. Because they got two more calls that need to be on. They don't want to No. They want they want they want this uh yeah. Use you guys in an escape go. We got some African Americans acting up. Yeah, I know, I know, let's be real. Yeah. I know how they are. I wouldn't I wouldn't bow people. Send me an orphan See, they hate me. They run for me. Every every chance they get, they run. Right. Because I, I quote the law to them. The law was there. Uh, what's the ticket? Oh, for for you being a bully on the block and, and turning up your music, excessive noise. Right. Big whippy. How much is that ticket? Ooh, $190. Give them 200 Tell them to keep the change and turn it up louder. I got to go follow them, guys. See ya. And everybody that...
identify myself, I will be arrested, correct? Legally, you have to identify yourself. So, that's what you're saying. That's what you're telling me. If I don't identify myself right now, I'm going to be arrested, right? That's that's what you're saying? Just tell me the word. We told you the same thing. Just tell me the word. Just tell me the word. That's fine, and I will no. give it to you, but you're saying if I don't provide that ID, you will arrest me, right? No, 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 no. Oh. And we're going to document that we spoke And that's fine. And that's fine. But so that's under threat of arrest, correct? No. So then I don't have to. Okay, so then why do I have to ID? Because we have to No, I'm okay. I'm okay. I'd rather not. So if you're not, then that's going to go to arrest. So then I will get arrested, correct? So under threat of arrest? So why, why are you making this harder than needs to be? I'm not. I'm just, I know my rights. So just I just, we're going we're gonna to ID okay. And that's fine. And that's fine. And that's fine. And I understand. But yeah, under, under threat of arrest? I mean, I just know my rights. No, no, no. I didn't, haven't no, done anything. But I, but I haven't done anything. What? What? What did you say? I didn't have anything. And I didn't, never, I didn't no, say anything listen, about that. What are you talking and about? That's fine. No, 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 and that's fine. Nobody had over No gun. And that's fine. No, so under threat that's of that's arrest. No, no, that's that's bothering me too. Guys. So if, I don't, okay, so if I don't give you my ID, yeah. so oh, if I don't give you my ID, you will arrest me. No, that's not true. That's not true. That's not true. What are you doing? Something illegal? I know. I read the thing. You don't have to give me your ID, but you have to give me your ID. Andrina, what are you doing? So, no, but listen. What else? But listen. Can you, can you just but listen, identify so if, if I don't identify myself, I will be arrested, he's, correct? He's, he's, I just want you to hear that. Yeah, yes? Yes. Don't. Okay. All right. Because That's all I needed to hear. Because no problem. No problem. That's all I needed to hear. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Here we go. That's under threat of arrest. I provided my ID. I just want you to know. That. No, it, it's not. No, it's not a stop in ID state. It's not a stop in ID state. I'm just telling you right now, it's not a stop in ID state. And that's fine. And I did. Under threat of arrest. You have to give me your ID. You have to just give me your name. That's no, no. You're twisting things now. No, no. But that's fine. No, you're twisting things. No, I just ask you. Just give me your name so we can write it down. Check it, and that's it. That's fine. I'll take this to court. That's no problem. Okay. Yeah, because you violated my rights right now. No, you no, are, not. but you are. No, we're not. You're president. Eight guys for what? But, but that's fine. Eight that's guys fine. for what? Eight, eight, eight policemen. You come in for what? <coughs> because there was a call from his job. That's fine. Regarding his welfare. <laughs> he Re said, she said, guys he, more. He, he said she, she said, right? So, that's okay. fine. Well, you, you got my ID, right? Yeah, we can Th this is not a problem. Okay, and I said I'm fine, right? This is not And then you threaten to arrest me if I don't give you my ID. Do you? Yeah. And document the situation that we came here. Yeah. Under threat, of, under threat of under threat of arrest. Is that what you told me? So to that's fine. Thanks, man. I don't understand why you keep saying threat of arrest. For because I I needed to hear that. No, that's no, that's but, all but that's evidence I can use. Like that's fine. Yes, and that's fine. And that's fine. Thank you. Very much. Goodbye. And that's fine. Okay. 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 And that's fine. Okay. 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 Just check it out. That's it. So 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 so. That's all it was. Okay. 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 All right, guys, how we doing? Everybody still with me? Everybody still cool? Let me ask you three questions. Okay. Question number one pertains to the last video. Now, the way I understand the law is, okay, the police can lie to you about anything. And to tell somebody, we're going to place you under arrest if you don't give us your ID, technically, they can, they can lie to you about this. But giving them your ID isn't where the violation happens. You surrendered your ID. Voluntarily. Granted, it was under the threat of arrest. But you still voluntarily did it. I don't believe you will have any type of lawsuit over this whatsoever. The way I understand the law is that they can demand your ID under the threat of arrest, but the violation only happens once they've arrested you for not IDing when there's no commission of any crime or any reason whatsoever to ID you. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. So that's question one. Question two. Do you folks think that the NFL is rigged? Like buy like big fucking bet MGM and all this and all those fucking casinos and shit. Do you think it's rigged? Because look, the reason why I'm asking you folks this is because a news media outlet I can't remember which fucking one it was because I was inebriated when I saw it. But I saw this Friday. Now on Friday they came out and said that 
they announced all these people. This schmuck is going to perform at the halftime show, and this schmuck is going to perform at the halftime show. And they said that all these people were going to be doing this halftime show when the Ravens play the 49ers. Now, this was Friday. How would they know that the 49ers were going to win? I, You know what I mean? Like, I feel like I just had a real Marty McFly moment here. Like, remember when he took the DeLorean and it was like he had that almanac? Kind of feel like that's happening here. I, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Here's the third question I have. With this invasion of illegal immigrants and terrorists that we have coming into our country. Now, look, check this out. I'm no expert on the art of war or anything, but I would assume that if I was a country who wished harm upon the United States, right now would be the prime opportunity to send a bunch of fucking people. I, this is just bad, right? This is just bad. But this is the thing. Biden and this, all these other Democratic schmucks keep saying, oh, all these illegal immigrants, all these illegal immigrants are going to help our economy. If... If 11 million illegal immigrants can help our economy, why the fuck couldn't they help theirs? Uh, hey, I don't know. Look, if you've made it this far, you've made it all the way to the fucking end. Let me know what you guys think. Very special thank you to the three channels I highlighted today. That was Good Guy Activism, Wolverine Transparency, and Dre Flacco. I always leave the original link in the description so you can click on them, head on over, let them know that we was getting wrecked. We was watching their shit. We love them. We support them. And we got their back. If you have a Facebook page, join us at the Us First MPGH Facebook group. My dude Chris will keep you entertained with shit all day long that you don't see on this channel. Uh, that all being said, folks, to the ones that love us, to the ones that have lost us, and to the ones that get to meet and hang out with a bunch of fucking kick-ass people like you and like me, you are important, you're cared for, you're valuable, and you're unbelievably appreciated. You are not fucking worthless, especially to this fucking guy. If no one has told you yet today, just know I love you over this bitch, and I will see you crazy motherfuckers tomorrow morning. Cheers, guys. Stay safe. If they die, for me to rise, then I fade. Wipe your spit from my face, wipe these tears from my eyes. No, if they die, for me to rise, then I fade. Wipe your spit from my face, wipe these tears from my eyes. I've got to take my life back, one chance to make it right. Yeah.